I can't tell you, even reruns, which I've seen, yeah. are funny. Yeah, I know, it's true. I, I, I this... know Jerry very well. I was in uh, his movie about the bees. Yes, right, right. I was Larry B. King. <laughs> Larry David is a riot. Right, they're very funny guys, and they are, they have a voice that is very unique. And um, it's also, it's like the Beatles in a way, frankly. It, it, you can't predict the Beatles before the Beatles happened. Like why, why do those four guys make such great, it's like there was no real predict, we thought the show would get canceled. That was a, a big part of the liberation of the show was, it's never gonna make it, so let's just do what we wanna do. And that's what the show became. The show became what we wanted it to be because we didn't care about the success. And then it wound up being successful. Was George the only real actor? Well, you had um, Michael, you know, the, Michael was from sketches for the most part, like Fridays. He was on Fridays with Larry and I. Uh, Julia also had come from sketch background, Northwestern University, Saturday Night Live. Um, so Jason had, Jason had won a Tony by then also. Yeah. He's a song and dance man as well. Really super talented I guy. I saw him do the producer. Yes, exactly. So um, they were all super talented, but they hadn't yet found the role. And you know that happens with James Gandolfini or John Hamm or, or Carol O'Connor. They get that role that winds up defining them. Mm. All right. I never knew any character like George. Yeah, <laughs> that's interesting. George was not a character I knew. Yeah, well, if you get to know Larry David better. <laughs> <laughs> Never miss a beat. Subscribe to Larry King now and watch new episodes every day.